Cancer, hello. Welcome back to those of you who have been here before and welcome to those of you who it's your first time. I'm Denise, this is Surrender to the Flow Tarot and I am going to do a timeless general reading for the collective of Cancer. Cancer Sun, Moon, Rising, Ascendant, or Venus. It's a general reading, it's not gonna resonate with everyone. Take what does, leave what doesn't. Be careful not to make yourself fit into a story that's not yours. You don't wanna relate, you wanna resonate. Okay, today's reading is, where's your head, where's your heart, how do you align it? Um, we're gonna use the fountain tarot for you. Ready? I almost said Gemini. Ready, Cancer? Seven of Cups for your head. Want to come out? Okay. Give me a moment. really interesting because it's fire and earth and the star is who's the star you got the star as your unifier Aquarius oh that makes so much sense <laughs> but it's not water is what I'm saying so you are out of your element you're feeling out of your element Partially. You're being called on right now to pay attention to your intuition. To let yourself transform right on the uh, bottom of the deck is the moon and underneath that is death. So how I'm feeling these is that you've been in an introspective period. You've been healing. You've, you have been pulled back. And you understand that a transformation needs to happen and you're letting it happen. You're letting it happen. Your head, you got Knight of Wands. Your heart, you got the Ace of Coins. And how to unify it going into the reverse is the star. But it came out sideways. Okay. First of all, this star is the best star card ever. Strip, uh, stripper. Regardless if she was, but a... 
a pole dancing, a pole dancing entity. It was the best, it's the best thing ever. Okay. This is about inner strength. This is a, about letting yourself be illuminated from the inside. It's, it's, it's about letting yourself trust in your intuition and in your magic. And it's taking that like all of the like impulsive, like very energetic force that you're feeling it's coming in mentally but it's coming out as in movement for you like your head wants to and your heart that's where your head is your head is in this like want to take immediate action you're really strong about what what you're feeling you support it but it's possibly you're not totally tied into your roots you know you're not totally um, tapped into your intuition. There's like the spontaneity, impulsive side that's kind of the dominant part of the Knight of Wands that's presenting itself in your brain right now. Your heart is in the Ace of Coins, which is the Ace of Pentacles, which is beautiful and wonderful. Your heart is open to receiving the gift from the universe in a brand new beginning in the starting of your legacy. So it's just about alchemizing that strong impulse that's pushing you in your head to like maybe act a little bit outside of your roots. You know what I'm saying? What you got in your unified is the star. So the way to bring the, your head and your heart together is to allow yourself the rewards that the universe is giving you for all of the work that you've done. So just let go of some of the control of this. You understand? Only take control of yourself. You can't control anyone else. You can't manipulate, like you can manipulate them, but that's not what you want to do. You don't want to come, you don't want to move from a place of manipulation. That's, I feel it. That's not what you want to do. Maybe that's what you've done in the past. And maybe you didn't realize it. Like using your really strong emotions to come present them to someone in a, in a situation that's ten, tenuous. And because of y your emphaticness, you the, the other party is swayed to you understand take that if it resonates however it resonates let me know in the comments okay so the universe is saying let's get an actual heart path oracle card for you i'm feeling it to explain this star a little bit more succinctly cancer the moon is you, by the way. I mean, it's Pisces, I think, but I can't, I always count it as Cancer. Always. Cancer and Pisces. Oh, look at that. Soul assistance, soul guidance, unique perspective. Do you need any more? I mean, come on. You got it all. Look at It's the alchemy of all these things coming together to give you something real tangible that is a collab with the universe. You are divinely guided. You can believe in that. You can believe in yourself and you can let the things unfold. All right, Cancer, this is exciting for you. You got this. Thank you for coming and sharing your energy with me. I hope that this helped and I will see you again next week. Bye, Cancer.